An elderly lady who looked in her 60s made a sudden stop in front of Molly. If she was not aware that they are in the midst of moving crowd and that possible collision of bodies would occur, Molly halted her feet and into tiptoes and walked around her. She then heard the old lady shouting towards what seemed to be her family of two generations who were just about to sit on a bench looking exhausted. Come, come, people. We don't have time to relax. Got to follow the schedule. Much more to see. Some of them are pointing and others were eyeing. They seem to be treading in their own pace and form of solitude. Perhaps it's only natural when you are among a crowd of strangers. Two men dressed as Roman soldiers approached Molly. One of them said, Chow, you look lovely. How about a photo of us three for a souvenir? Molly was intrigued by their armors and their chiseled faces, but she was too shy to have anything to do with them. So she shook her head with a slight grin and stepped away. The same one followed her. Are you sure you don't want a photo of us? Only 20 euros. As you can see, we are the only ones in these fine costumes. Molly quickened her pace to get away. And then after a moment, she looked back and saw them went on haggling other tourists. And before she could look straight ahead, she bumped into a tall figure and stepped on his foot. Ouch! Someone yelped. Her face was flustered. Oh, I'm so sorry. Watch where you're going, he said half-jokingly. I'm really sorry, Molly repeated. Apology accepted. He grinned, and instead of moving aside to let Molly pass, he just stood there and say, I know someone who has a bag just like yours. Molly was startled by his remark and his possible intention of a conversation. She was not sure whether to move on or to stay, and before she reached out that decision, he continued, traveling alone, uh, y yes, Molly regretted as soon as she answered him. Why don't you join us, he said. We're heading north to Santa Marinala. Who's we? Suddenly a girl came over and placed her arm over the guy's shoulder. Who is this, she asked. He smirked and said, yeah, who are you? I'm Molly. Well, nice to meet you, Molly, the girl shook her hand and said. Where are you from? The States. Me too, she grinned and pointed at the guy. This is Zach. I'm Amy. And those people over there are Karen, Sean, Nick, and Melissa. Just as she finished, the rest of the group waved at her. So you want to join us? Asked Zach. Yeah, come on, Amy encouraged. It's dangerous for a girl to be traveling alone. Amy could be right, Molly thought. Maybe this was a sign from her mother.